You know, I kind of like watching CNN from time to time. Kind of. From time to time. Your gumball makes sport of me. But, then, <laughs> but all these news channels, they end up like hiring these these guys that make you not want to watch anymore. Yeah. For me, it's Martin uh, Bashir. That fucking asshole. I fucking, asshole. way before this clip that we're about to play, uh -huh. I couldn't stand watching him at all. Yeah. Like, who makes these decisions over there? Yeah, really. And then the MSNBC it? did it with the Al Roker. Although he's, Unwatchable. He's the one that got I'll that welcome. information out of Michael Jackson about sleeping with the different kids in the oh, bed. Oh, good for fucking him. But, I mean, as a regular you know, news guy, he sucks on CNN. I can't watch him at all. What did he say? Did he, did he say that the IRS is the new nigger? Is that what he said? Yeah, on his yeah. Blog we got the clip. Yeah, he's oh, got, oh, he said it yeah, he's okay. got the whole, uh, yeah. whole reason Let's why he's Let's see if he's thinks. fired. No, he won't be fired. Despite the complete lack oh. of any evidence linking the president to the targeting of Tea Party groups, Republicans are using it as their latest weapon in the war against the black man in oh, the White shut House. Shut the fuck up. This strategy is nothing new, and it oh. was explained way back in 1981 by Lee Atwater, who was Bush 41's chief strategist. In a tape recording, Mr. Atwater revealed how Republicans evolve their language to achieve the same purpose. He oh. said, you start out in 1954 by saying N word, N word, N word. N word. By 1968, you can't say N word. That hurts you. Backfires. So you say stuff like forced busing, states' rights, and all that stuff, and you're getting so abstract. Now you're talking about cutting taxes. We want to cut this is much more abstract than even the busing thing, and of a hell of a lot more abstract than N word, N word. So this afternoon, we welcome the latest okay. phrase in the lexicon of Republican attacks on this president, the IRS. Three letters that sound so they, innocent, but we know what you mean. Oh, so fucking far They fucking, far the IRS was doing this, you <laughs> dumb fucking IRS. They are, they, they were, but that, that he didn't, the way he said that is, he didn't say what they said he said. He didn't say what they said he, like, no, but yeah, he, they, he's they saying. That IRS is just another code word that the Republicans are using, like when they say uh, force busing and yeah, things yeah, like yeah. that, that just mean nigger. No, no, but I mean saying, I, the way it was written up, it made it look like he actually just because, said, the IRS is the new nigger. But he didn't, I, I mean, the, the way he phrased it right. was from a train, a, a train of thought, uh -huh. nowhere near what they said. It. They're completely far-fetched. And I think he's misquoting, argument. he could be misquoting uh, Atwater because, yeah. like, not misquoting him, but misquoting his intention. Like, cause if, I mean, was he saying, this is what we're creating? You can't say nigger nigger anymore, so you got to say that. Or was he just kind of saying that's the logical progression of how things happen? Right. But his point is, is completely ridiculous anyway because yeah. um, it, it's not like they make, they're making things up. It's been acknowledged, yes, the IRS did target conservative groups yep. when uh, these groups would go for um, a tax-exempt yeah. status. They let through liberal groups with uh, out any issue, and conservative groups had to wait, put them on these endless waiting lists, ask them questions that they never asked the liberal groups, things like this. Uh, so it's not like this didn't happen, and they're trying to... Make right. a new right. way to say it. it's ridiculous. And as as far as being an attack on the president and no evidence linking it to the White House, sure. At, at, at this point, right now, there isn't. But the the White House is the leadership, yep. and that is what is supposed to make sure things like this don't happen. It wasn't a rogue IRS agent. This was a concerted effort right. by uh, the Internal Revenue Service to fuck with conservative groups. And uh, as the president, regardless if it goes right up to you and has your signature on it or not, you're the guy responsible. And that's something that this White House and president have uh, amazingly steered clear of every controversy and scandal and, and, and cover-ups, if you want to talk about that with Benghazi. Uh, they're amazing at doing that. Look at this fucking... How, how does fucking Holder still have a job? How did this fucking rice... Get appointed head of the fucking president's, uh, the um, uh, head of security, uh, national security. This is unbelievable. You think Eric Holder uh, keeps his job? Yeah, because he's Still. black. How, but how does Eric, he's black. Eric Holder is a fucking snake. Yeah. He's a snake. 
I, I, I believe he's perjured himself. Yeah. And, uh, you know, but but because they're black, this will not fucking affect them. You can't jump on them because you get people like this asshole that then brings the race fucking angle into it, and which has nothing. The IRS scandal has nothing to do with race. Is nothing. It, isn't it, that is really enraging that the president is involved in scandal like every fucking president right. winds up in. Yes. And this cunt, Martin Bush, and he is a cunt. Oh, sure. Makes it look like it's because there's a black man and the yeah. white... Like, are you, th you, first of all, you don't, you're not even from here, you fuck. You don't, yeah. don't act like you understand all the intricacies of the fucking, of racial dynamics here, you twat. Please. You twat. They, any time you disagree with this president and his policies, it will uh. always come back. Somebody will always tag it as you're being racist. You are, uh, you don't like the fact that there's a black man in the White House. You fuck. They never just say, well, that guy, I guess, doesn't agree with his policies. He thinks they're bad for the country. But no, they, they always want to pull the fucking race card out when they don't have an argument right. on the other side. And that way, it cuts the argument. It turns it into something else. Yep. Now you can't discuss the issue because obviously you're a racist if you discuss it. So, um, yeah, he's, a, he's an asshole. Where is he from, England? Yeah, I don't know. Great, uh, great time they're having over there with their fucking... Racial diversity, huh? But but that's the thinking o over there. Well, that, that yeah, it's like that's that's the thinking. What he just said, this fucking uh -huh. irrational. They're worse there than we are here with being TC. Terrible. They're the worst. The first thing that fucking twat. What's his name? Uh, Cameron says. Oh, you know, it's not all Muslims. Shut up. Yeah. Who what? cares if it is? They're the ones identifying themselves as, as they're doing this for uh, fucking Islam. Yeah. They act like the rest of us are going. It's Islam. You know why we say it's Islam? Because they say it. <laughs> hey, why'd you do that? Islam. Oh, thanks. All right. But then if you say, hey, that's Islam, you're Islamophobic. Stop it. God, how fucking irrational these thought police are. Yeah. Uh, there you go. Yeah. Islam. Ugh. Just sounds horrible. <laughs> hello, Wigbo. Hello, Wigbo. I love that. Hello, hello. Hello, Wigbo. You know, I try. Hello, Wigbo. I do. Hello. And I... then they start yelling at Fez. Hello, Wigbo. Hello. And then they blow up. <laughs> I do a bit on that in stage, and I could never get it like Ant. I could never hello. say it like. Hello, Wigbo. I can't hello. do it like you. Hello, hello, hello. Those videos are great. They're like, hello, hello. They just start, <laughs> they start out like, hello, hello. Hello, 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 hello. It's easy to, to you know, watch it on, on YouTube. But <laughs> on video, yeah. Fuck, if you're in the middle of Times Square and you hear that, oh, oh shit. Oh, boy, run. Fuck. Run, runny, run, run. <laughs>